Hello. In this video, I will explain hash functions. Hash functions are mathematical functions which convert input data into the output of its length. They are widely used in cryptographic world. They are also used to calculate data integrity. There are different form of hash functions. Most widely used are message digest and SHA, secure hash algorithms. Message digest, also called as MD, is cryptographically broken, out of which MD5 is widely used hash function. SHA compromises, SHA0, SHA1, SHA2, and SHA3. SHA3 is most latest. SHA2 is most widely used and it has a sub variance. SHA2 224, SHA256, SHA324, SHA512. Out of which SHA256 and SHA512 are commonly used. Embed TLS provide function to calculate all of them. Okay, let's switch to the code. For SHJ, I am using same project created for last video. Link to the last video is given into the description. First step is to add SHJ256 and SHJ512 source file from embed TLS level. For that, go to embed TLS library in project, new file, then advanced because I'm not going to add source file directly as a copy but link to the source file to the project. Browse project middle level embed TLS library. Select SHA256 and SHA512. I'm not going to select them because these files are already added to the project. Okay. Then SHA.HP. It is a wrapper created for SHA calculation. I am also going to demonstrate you how to use template specialization. Primary template is empty class. Then temp class, template class specialized for SH 256. Template class specialized for SH 112. and make a call is a function for embed TLS library. I kept it simple. Okay. Then main file, which is quite similar to earlier with small modification. Here, instance of SHA with template parameter SHA 256 is created as I am interested to calculate SHA 256. Input and length of the data and finish the SHA calculation and copy result into the digest which is passed as a pointer okay and here data from UART is collected data from UART goes to the ring buffer which I have explained in the last video link to the video is given in description 
when the data of block size is collected, calculate the SHG and the SHG value sent back on UR. Okay, I have applied the code on my STM board and I'm using add to send message. Here is my text message of size 32 byte. Let me clear the terminal first. Good. I'm sending the message. And here is the result. Let's compare this result with result from another source. Here I had copied the message and the SH value is 18303E. 18303E which is similar to the our calculation. That's all about the session.